Hello lovely family and friends. Welcome back to my channel Dovi's Kitchen. I hope you are all doing great. In today's video we are making shawarma using homemade shawarma bread. It's so simple to make. After watching this video you will not buy shawarma again. You will always make it at home. This is a very detailed video. We are going to make our own shawarma bread. So let's start. I have here one tablespoon of yeast. Let's activate the yeast by adding some sugar. We will stir it and cover it for about 5 to 10 minutes. I am using warm water. I have here two cups of flour. I just added half teaspoon of salt. I will mix it and add the activated yeast and mix everything together. I will now use my hands to mix it whilst adding the water in bits. I'm using 3 quarter cup of water. I'm going to mix it till it forms a dough. When it starts forming a dough, I'll add 1 tablespoon of oil and knead it until it turns out smooth. I'll cover it and let it rest for about 10 minutes. We are now going to mix the marinade for the chicken. This is curry powder, ginger and garlic powder, chili pepper, oyster sauce, olive oil, all pepper seasoning, and lemon juice. I'll mix everything together. I just added some chicken seasoning. Now I'll add my chicken pieces and mix it very well so that the marinade can go to every part of the chicken. The oyster sauce is salty that is why I didn't add any salt to the chicken. I'll put it aside for about 15 to 30 minutes to marinate well. Let's now continue with the shawarma bread. Sprinkle some flour on the work surface so that the dough will not stick on it. I'll continue to knead the dough for about 2 to 3 minutes. I'll now make it into a log form. Divide it and make it into a ball. Let's now flour the rolling pin so that the dough will not stick on it. I'll roll it out in a flat round shape, just like this. I have a heated griddle on fire. I'll put it on it and cook it on both sides. You can also use your frying pan.
we are done. It's so simple to make. Look at it. Let's now pan fry our chicken. It has marinated very well. I will continue flipping it over until it's well cooked. I'm adding some onion to the chicken. I'm doing this because I want to infuse the flavor of grilled onion in my chicken. Our chicken is ready. I'm now grilling my green and red bell pepper for just 30 seconds. This is optional, I just don't want it raw. Let's now make our sauce. I'm using about 3 tablespoons mayonnaise. Let's add tomato ketchup. chili pepper and honey if you have sweet chili sauce you can use it you don't need to use the chili pepper and honey I will now mix it very well Look at it, very yummy and smooth. Everything is now set. Let's put all the vegetables together and add salt and vinegar and stir. I have cabbage, carrots, cucumber, green and red bell pepper, and onion. Let's take one of the shawarma bread and spread the sauce on it. You can spread more of it if you like. I will now add the vegetables and then the chicken pieces. I'll add some of the fresh onions in addition to the grilled one. I'll top it up with the sauce and wrap it. That's all. Let's wrap it in another way. Let's 
if today is your first time here you are warmly welcome please like share leave a comment and subscribe You can grill it again in a pan after wrapping it to make it crunchy on the outside. We are done. It's so simple and it's very delicious. Let me cut it for you to see. Yummy! To all my subscribers and returning viewers, Thank you so much for your support. Bye.